Hi, how are you? This is Nazma Misty. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Today I will show you how to use a Google analytical platform to be able to that how to add it to your click funnel so you know you can track there as well. So that's really kind of like it's nice to know, right? You want to know thoroughly about your old contents you're creating and who have been watching, who have been clicking on it, who are visiting. So I think that I mean I mean I believe this is a cool thing. So So, so let's start measuring. My account name would be Mantra Ebook Frame 1 because I might have it from another account. Okay. Wanna deliver. And you'd rather click all of them than you know skip it onto something. I mean it's a bigger uh, property name ebook. Small business. So the category I would say my category would be let's go online communities. That's not something, right? Mm -hmm. Books, literature, but it's just a way to you know how to say that. It's like your book on all online digital marketing stuff, all things. So let's say internet. That's not something as well. What else we could have? Sorry. Um, okay, so I'm going to do job and education, huh? Okay. I'm small. I'm the only person. Employee or employer. Okay, so I'm going to collect, uh, select measure customer engagement with my site or app. Measure lead generation. Analyze my online sales, optimize my site, and um, yeah, I'm not advertising or anything, so accept and accept, okay? And accept. You just keep accepting until it gives you no choice to accept. Save. Okay, now we're going to choose a platform. Let's choose web. Website URL, my website URL, which one I'll give. Um, I would like to give um, this clip funnel, but I have other funnels. I'm going to give eInfo marketing.com. That's my website, right? Or you could give this one the first one, right? I would say let me give this one. <clears throat> because it's going to just analyze it, right? So I'm going to give, I don't have to do space here. My website, streaming, the info market. Ebook, no. Ebook, infos. And that's pretty much it. Now let's, okay. I'm going to do this one. Okay. Sorry, this is. Okay. It already has HTTPS, so I was copy pasting too much. So create a stream. Okay. So this is just, you know, once you have your click funnel and you want to analyze it, how is it working out? And Sometimes, but I mean, you know, like when they're clicking onto it, they're not somebody, their email, right? So you don't have any contact to see. But I would say that when you have the data, you will know that who are clicking, how many people are clicking. Because first thing first, you want to see that it's available, it's working on the you know internet platform, right? People are clicking or not, that's something. And then that comes like, they're actually giving out the contacts there, then they're buying or not. And when you're giving out free bucks, you don't have to worry about purchasing, and then they're purchasing or not. But at the end, that's what we want, okay? So, okay, there we are. I'm going very slow because I'm, I'm slow myself, and I'm going slow as well. I just love it. So right now, once you create that, 
this one right here. part was here before right so once you create it's going to bring you here google side tag okay this is the one the first one let me see what's in there google side tag let's click on it this is your edge tracking code global side tag let me see if it's same already have it installed here, okay, so nothing I gotta do. I just want to check if it's seeing the same one. Okay, no, it's not the same and I don't need it either. So, yeah, that's it basically, guys. And, um, that's it. Is there anything else you need? And write something or nothing you need? Connected text, nothing. For now, for a click menu to see how, how many people are clicking on it. So, for that, this is it, the Google Site Tag, okay? There are other Tag Manager, tags, Site Tags, more tagging settings. Like, you don't, you don't need them now. I would say that once you know how to eat a beef steak, right? Because I'm hungry, I'm talking, giving an example of food. Well, once you know what is a beef steak or you have had one, then next time before choosing, before having it, you can choose that the other day I have something, today I'll have something else. Or you literally, you know, you know, you, you just know things, you know. So that's it. And we will So let's just. So I wanted to use it for somewhere, but I don't need it. That's okay. So that's all you just create and. You're done. And how do you see it, right? That's it. You're done. So how do you see it? You see it literally. You go to reports. It's an analytic thing. Mine should be nothing because I just created, right? It's zero zero. But you will see that over time there will be some numbers, new users, total revenue, all this stuff. You will see over time, okay? There are the things and. This is the admin thing, like property settings, account settings, all these things. But it's not complicated, you just know things over time. Okay? Don't just, it's just something you don't have to. This is your email account, so that's pretty much. We wanted to hit track and code, right? So we just got it. And I'm just showing you so you get familiar to these things, like what it is. But you actually don't need it here, that's okay. So that's it, then you'll just come to analytics and come to this report because you already have it here. You created your account, right? I mean, you connected it with your email account to the funnel URL or your website URL, you know, just so nice. And that's it pretty much, right? That's the topic we wanted to create content about today's in today's video, okay? Okay guys, I hope you have enjoyed. So thank you so much for watching. If you like it, I mean if you do like my content, so you can subscribe or you know you can comment about about it and take care of yourself. Have a great week. Thank you so much.